All right, hello everyone. It's Josh here and I am in Boston. We've got the beautiful Boston Park behind me, Boston Commons. On this trip, we are gonna be doing three different Marriott luxury properties in three nights, that's right. We're gonna start with the Marriott Longmore. Next up, we're gonna be doing the Ritz Carlton Boston. And then finally, we're gonna be doing the Liberty Luxury Collection Boston. All very nice, expensive hotels. Really excited to review them all. I'll let you know which one is the best and which one you should stay at when you visit Boston. All right, let's get started. All right, we are at now the Liberty Hotel Boston. This is a luxury collection hotel by Marriott. I was here a year and a half ago for five nights. I'm so excited to be back. Uh, when I was here, everything was completely closed. Things are gonna be open again, so I'm really excited to check it out. This actually used to be a jail. Uh, they've converted it into a hotel. Um, it is absolutely amazing from what I remember. I'm excited to be back. We're only here for one night, uh, but let's go check it out. All right, we are here at the Liberty Hotel Boston. We just checked in, had an excellent experience. We're now in our room. We're actually in the corner room here at the end of the 14th floor. Uh, there's only 15 floors, uh, but let's go take a look inside. But this is the highest room for the floor we have, uh, which is actually a little bit bigger room. There. All right, <laughs> so let's head on in. We have a nice little like walkway coming on in. And then as we turn the corner here, we have an absolute incredible, incredible room. Incredible Charles River view. Two huge queen size beds. Um, I actually had the same room uh, a year and a half ago. Incredible experience, so I really wanted to come back. Very, very nice, clean. You cannot you cannot beat this these views. Like just looking out, beautiful. We usually got a nice work desk here. Um, looks like they even have a little welcome. A note for us. Beds are very comfortable from what I remember. Uh, Full-size bottles of water, uh, which is a great touch. Uh, definitely excited. Now let's check out the bathroom. The bathroom is actually one of the best features of this hotel because it's huge. Uh, come on in. We have a private little shower here. Uh, to the right, we've got that molten brown soap. Uh, very nice touch. In here, we've got a huge mirror, huge tub, uh, toilet, a lot of amenities. Uh, normally, there's a beautiful room view of this big window. I haven't opened it yet. Uh, but so far, absolutely amazing room. Okay, now for a little details of the room. So this is really cool. This is our nightstand. It looks like a safe. And guess what? Guess what's inside? <laughs> we actually have our safe in there. Uh, so that's really cool. Also, over here in our little drawers, we have a fridge. It's a nice big fridge, which is nice. Got some drawers here. This uh, work desk has some power outlets. This phone, has some good views. Uh, very, very nice. All right, we are here at the Liberty. The sun has set. We got an incredible night vibe here. Uh, this was a jail at one point. They have done an incredible job retrofitting this place. It absolutely is amazing. They've also got some decorations for Christmas and the holidays up. Very cool. This uh, hotel brings back a lot of memories for me being here a year and a half ago. Just a very, very great, fun spot. This hotel, uh, Monday through Saturday, they said, is pretty much always sold out, like 100%. They actually have like a DJ booth uh, right across the way. Uh, they play some uh, live music those nights. So Sunday is the night that's a little bit less occupancy. We happen to be here on a Sunday, so we're able to experience that. Um, definitely a hopping place, a good place to check out if you're in town. I can only imagine how exciting things get here on that Monday through Saturday when all that music and fun stuff's going on in the lobby. Okay, now for the review of the Liberty Hotel Boston. So I'm gonna go ahead and we're gonna start uh, with the room, definitely five out of five. I did use a Sweet Night Award. I uh, to get upgraded to the deluxe uh, corner room, larger guest room, upper floor with the two queen beds. Definitely best view in the house, as you can see. Beautiful Charles River view room. Uh, beautiful. Definitely everything was clean. Everything was very nice. I'm uh, very excited about the room. Uh, next up, Inspiration. Inspiration is definitely going to get a 4.5 out of 5 for me. Uh, while it's not completely perfect or like blown away, it is really high up there. Uh, 
definitely a hotel I would come back to. Uh, next up is going to be service. Uh, service, I'm going to give 4.5 out of 5 just because it's a luxurious hotel. All the service was great. It's just no one really went above and beyond. Uh, and then uh, finally, the value to me, uh, definitely going to give it a 4.5 out of 5. I would come back. Uh, next time I'm in Boston, it is very nice here. Uh, so overall, really great score for this hotel. Definitely recommend checking it out. Uh, definitely between the three hotels we stayed at on this trip, uh, the Marriott Longworth, Ritz-Carlton, the Liberty, um, this one is definitely, definitely up there and one I would come back to.